other ferry boat heading back. They're going back to Hatteras and we're going to uh, Ocracoke. And it's raining a little bit, but we're headed we're headed towards Ocracoke right now. Is that Ocracoke over there? No. Really? No, it's a little ways, about 40 minutes. Yeah. Oh, well, we're here at the uh, yeah. Ocracoke ponies. They have them penned, I guess, for safety, but they're descendants of the Spanish Mustangs that were lost at sea when people when um they were coming over here. Here we get some on the camera here. So they're descendants of Spanish Mustangs. What happened to the Spanish Mustangs? Well, some of them got lost, Colin, in the uh, in like shipwrecks and stuff. And while the people died, were they were they able to on? swim ashore and live. Why were they even on ships? Well, they were bringing them over for workhorses and stuff. And sometimes they uh, even released them after they didn't need them for work anymore, and they just um, became wild, wild horses. But you see a lot up in uh, the northern part of the Outer Banks. All right, we're at this, uh, at the visitor center. Behind the visitor center is a uh, old family uh, grave, grave site, cemetery. They have them all over these islands. The people who lived here in, 19, in the 1900, 1898. And this one was restored by the great-grandchildren of the Scarborough family in 2003, but the, the grave sites are, this one's 1902, and I can't really read it. There's a whole Bible verse or something on there that I can't read or a quote, but they have it fenced off. I ain't going to get in trouble for going in. And the other gravestone is for a two-month-old. 1898 or 96? 96. Yeah, 96. No, it looks like 98. No, it's 96. 96. It's 1896. I think it says 1898. No, it's died on 98. He was born. Oh, okay. Born 1896, died in 1998. Two years old. And uh, F. Children of. The stone's that old. That's pretty neat. These old family grave sites are pretty neat. Oh, okay. Two on that stone. Okay, there's right there. there's two children underneath this stone. Okay, so this is maybe mother, maybe this is mother and father, and because there's only is there only one name on this stone? As far as I can read it. Yeah, well, can't really read it because it's so faded because it's so old. But there's two children in this grave. But All right. There's two next to each other. That's interesting. They put the two children together. Ninety-six and ninety-eight. Uh, pretty neat. I think that is two people. Cause look, to Sal to the Salisbury, um, mm. born. Uh, Maybe we should put a family no, plot in a trailer park. All right. Right, Colin. You could be buried down by the creek. Nah, I want to be buried. Deep in the woods. I like that. All right. House. What's that? I like the North Carolina lighthouse. Cape Hatteras lighthouse with the stripes. Uh huh. All right, so down here in Ocracoke right. Island, in here. This is the Ocracoke Lighthouse. Yeah. So you can't really go up in it. They don't. I see. Oh Son. my God. <laughs> you can't really go up in the lighthouse now, but it's cool to see. That's the reason I like the North Carolina Lighthouse there, because you can go up in it. Yeah, the Cape Hatteras Lighthouse. You we were up in it last year. This lighthouse was built in 1823. It's a two story structure. And originally, the lighthouse keeper and his family lived in here. Today, it's a private residence. Man, I would love to live here. How cool would that be? There you go. That is the Ocracoke Lighthouse, built in 
Cove's over. We're leaving Ochre Cove Island. And this is the Croatian. Point is where the lighthouse is in, in Hatteras. Oh. Okay, well that's it. Oh, the Croatia right here. You can see it behind me. Ferry boat on the North Carolina ferry system. And the video you just saw was from Okokoke. It wasn't much. We didn't see much, but uh, we went to the lighthouse. Yeah, we saw an old cemetery. And uh, these pictures right here that I'm showing you are from the uh, Ochre Cup Watermen Association, the local seafood, uh, the local uh, fishermen cast their seafood. Right there. We got. Tell us what we bought from the local fishermen. We got bluefish. Bought her from all from the Ochre Cove Watermen Association. Local fishermen. Local fishermen, all local. There you go. Ochre Cove, North Carolina. Nice place to visit. Well, there is a lot of uh, stores, but if you come around, you can find the uh, you can find the local stores. And stay away from the junk stores, the uh, tourist traps. Yeah, but you can find some good stores if you drive on the back roads. Find some cool uh, studios or whatever. But other than that, it's a nice little island to visit. There's the. Uh, there's they were just slowing down for the other ferry. Oh. You got two of them running. All right, I hope you enjoyed that little video. Boom! Have a nice day. Oh, he's going on YouTube.